Hello everyone, I'm Zijin, and I'd like to welcome you to OPPO Inno Day 2022. Since its debut in 2019, OPPO Inno Day has become the place for us to share our technology breakthroughs with the world. By joining us today, you will be the first to see the innovations we have been working on over the past year and get a better idea about where we want to lead the industry next. We are incredibly proud of the breakthrough technologies we have introduced over the past three years. Like the rollable OPPO X 2021 concept phone, the Mary Silicon X imaging MPU, and the foldable fan end with flexion hinge, which will see a new generation launching in the Chinese market soon. Last year, we also launched the first commercially available assisted reality glasses, OPPO Air Glass. I'm actually wearing the latest generation of OPPO Air Glass 2 today as my teleprompter. It only weighs about 38 grams, and its screens are so discreet that it's hard to tell it apart from regular glasses. In order to achieve the super lightweight, robust design of Air Glass 2, we developed the world's first resin optical waveguide lens. These lenses will support vision correction and further customization. But it's not just the lenses we have improved. The size and weight of the micro LED projectors on the glasses have been significantly reduced and we also added microphones and speakers to Air Glass 2. So, it not only works as a teleprompter and music player. You can also use it to make phone calls, translate foreign languages in real time, or navigate your way around new places. It can also transform voice to text for the hearing impaired. In the future, we believe Air Glass 2 could make smart, assisted reality glasses a necessity rather than a novelty. All these innovations that I've mentioned represent the passion of everyone at OPPO and our drive to constantly push the boundaries of technology, empowering people to get the best out of life. It's been so rewarding to see that our products, packed with innovative technologies, are now available in over 60 countries and regions worldwide. Thanks to our localized features and services, over 500 million users choose OPPO. You are the reason we keep moving forward and the inspiration behind every innovation. Looking to the future with inspiration ahead, which is our brand proposition. We will continue to evolve our brand and business to deliver more value for both consumers and society, to help make the world a better place. This ethos has led us to understand that inspiration matters, no matter where it comes from. So earlier this year, we launched the first OPPO Innovation Accelerator to inspire and empower technology professionals and entrepreneurs to innovate for the greater good. Under this year's theme of virtuous innovation, we invited individuals and teams to share their innovative solutions to challenges across accessible technology and digital health. Over three months, we selected 10 top proposals out of 536 entries from 39 countries and regions. OPPO is now working with these winners to help them bring their inspirations to life and create a better future together. Of course, our quest for virtuous innovation isn't over yet and we are glad to invite more partners who share the same goal to join us on this mission. Never before have we, as a global community, needed so much to be open in order to inspire greater confidence and optimism. Together, we become stronger. Together, we are ready to do even more. Therefore, we at OPPO are determined to play our part in empowering a better future. 
we will commit ourselves to be more inclusive than ever before, opening ourselves up to greater collaboration, better innovation, and more possibilities. By embracing a spirit of openness and inclusivity, we will make the best technology experiences available to all to help us build a future that lives up to our values. We introduced the 3 plus M plus X technology development strategy at InnoDay 2020. The three here refers to the three underlying pillars of hardware, software, and services, which will help OPPO create more integrated smart lifestyles for people worldwide. True smart living means intelligent experiences, and we want to bring them to even more aspects of your life, including smart productivity, smart entertainment, smart health, and smart learning. We hope to open up more possibilities for a future without boundaries, in which people can enjoy their best lives. We're now working hard to push this strategy forward with some exciting technology breakthroughs. To share what we've been up to on the hardware side, let's bring in Jiang Bo. Hello everyone, I'm Jiang Bo, Senior Director at OPPO. I'm really excited to be here today to give you a preview of our latest advancement in chip technology. Last year, at Indodi 2021, we introduced to the world OPPO's first self-developed dedicated image MPU, Mari Silicon X. With his help, OPPO users are now able to enjoy advanced smartphone features like 4K Ultra Night Video and 4K Ultra HDR Video. Mari Silicon X represented a critical breakthrough in our chip and D. And it's something we are extremely proud of here at OPPO. But our chip development didn't stop there. Today, I'm proud to unveil the second member of Mari Silicon family. Let me introduce OPPO's brand new Bluetooth Audio SoC, Mari Silicon Y. The flagship level Bluetooth Audio SoC marks a new breakthrough in OPPO's audio technology and is the latest milestone in a decade of non-stop audio innovation. It is also OPPO's first complete SoC solution, representing the next level in our chipset design capabilities. You might be asking, why create a Bluetooth Audio SoC? The tech industry has never really perfected wireless audio quality. Even though Bluetooth headphones have become one of the key ways that people listen to music now. And it's not just audio quality that requires great computational power. AI now gives us more freedom to choose how we listen and has created new immersive audio experience that plays extra demand on device-side computing power. My Silicon Y is designed to solve the key limitations of Bluetooth audio, setting new standard for performance with 12 megabit per second data rate and 590 gobs of computing power, based on the latest N6F semiconductor technology for wireless connectivity. Let me explain in more detail. First, let's take a closer look at the sound quality problem. As technology has evolved over the past decade, most people today are turning to their smartphones with wireless earphones for their audio entertainment. However, the bandwidth of the standard Bluetooth protocol is unable to support both ultra high resolution and loosely compression for hi fi music. Users expect high quality wireless audio, but instead, are usually faced with having to make a choice. Sacrifice audio quality for wireless convenience, or enjoy loosely hi-fi music using high-end but less convenient wired device. 
To deal with this problem, Mario Silicon Y introduced a brand new self-developed Pro Bluetooth pack. The first of its kind to deliver ultra high resolution loosely audio over Bluetooth. This complete solution combines massively expanded Bluetooth bandwidth with Oppo's proprietary Kutek technology to deliver fast and seamless wireless connectivity. With this Pro Bluetooth pack, we can transmit 192 kHz 24-bit ultra high resolution lossy audio through Bluetooth for the first time ever. So you can get all the benefits of wireless connectivity with the same audio quality as a wired connection. As I mentioned, the bandwidth of standard Bluetooth protocol is constrained. So for our solution, we have upped the bandwidth by a massive 50% compared with even the highest spec Bluetooth SoC on the market, giving us a huge 12 megabit per second. This is more than enough bandwidth to process the large amount of data to deliver end-to-end -end loose list audio transmission. This is also the first time that such large Bluetooth bandwidth has been put to use in this way. To make sure we get the most out of these bandwidth, we have also tailor-made a new codec technology for Mari Silicon Y. The Ultra Resolution Lossless Codec, or URLC, is a proprietary ultra high resolution lossless Bluetooth transmission protocol built by OPPO. It maximizes the lossless compression rate for any type of audio, enabling higher bitrate audio to be transmitted with less data and without any impact on audio quality. In addition, the URLC also supports smart adaptive data rate, which can be adjusted to the available bandwidth according to the IF environment and the external conditions to ensure a seamless listening experience. Listen to this piece of music. What you are hearing now is 192 kHz 24-bit Lucy audio which is typical of quality you could expect, even when we have loosely music streaming sources. Now, this track is 192 kHz, 24 bits loosely. Due to the equipment we are using, it is not that easy to hear the difference. So we are pulled out the parts that have been lost, so you can identify the difference more easily. You can see from the waveforms how the high sampling rate allows for richer details to come through in the soundtrack without distortion. Every bit of the original sound can be retained in our ultra clear lossless audio so that the music you hear is identical to the original recording. In recent years, we have also noticed that more people want to personalize their listening experience and we want to ensure they can take the full advantage of developments in audio AI without sacrificing audio quality. For this, we need to ensure our own device computing power is up to the job. That is why we have included a dedicated NPU within Mari Silicon Y. This makes Mari Silicon Y the only Bluetooth SoC on the market with an integrated NPU. And with it, we can build the next generation of audio applications through AI, creating a more directional and spatial listening experience in real time for a level of immersion that's never been seen or heard before. Mary Silicon Y's NPU can independently deal up to an incredible 590 gobs computing power. This is more than enough 
to support any real-time audio processing requirement. And put my silicon Y head and shoulders above other Bluetooth SoC available on the market. This enhanced on-device computing power gives us more possibilities to create an unbelievable spatial audio experience, something which has become more and more important for consumers when deciding which audio device to purchase. Leveraging the computing power of Mary Silicon Y, we have pushed the immersive audio to the limit in order to create a more interactive experience. Behind this are two principal technical features enabled by the chip, music extraction and spatial rendering. Using AI computing, music extraction can intelligently recognize and isolate the sound of specific stems, such as vocals, drum, bass, and other instruments. Once the sound has been isolated, users can place it anywhere within the virtual audio space in real time. Sounds good? Well, let's hear it in action. Unlike others, we want you to be able to enjoy any song or any track, exactly how you want to, placing yourself at the center of a 360-degree concert. The original track doesn't need to be included in any particular format. The on-device AI capabilities of My Silicon Y does all the heavy lifting for you, letting you act as your own mix engineer with any ordinary music file. If you want even more control over your own favorite sound sound, you can separate the key parts of the track. You can see here we have four different parts. Then choose how to move them around your virtual space and decide whether you want to dial up certain elements, perhaps the drums or the vocals, to give the experience your own unique flavor. Traditionally, this type of editing is only possible using professional multi-track audio engineering files. But now you have unlimited freedom to create a fresh spatial listening experience. That's exactly how you like it, real time and on device. This is just the first step in exploring what can be achieved with Mary Silicon Y's on device AI computing power. Also, Mary Silicon Y delivers its industry leading computational performance with incredible power efficiency. It is built on the most advanced N6i process technology. As one of the world's first SOC to use N6i, Mary Silicon Y shows how far we have come in our ability to in house design complex systems based on cutting edge process node. The N6i process delivers 66% higher power efficiency of the transceiver, while least reducing its physical size by 33%. This allows Mary Silicon Y to pack the full capabilities of both hardware and software in a compact chip, delivering flagship wireless connectivity without draining the battery. So, there you have it, Mary Silicon Y. Mary Silicon Y, a flagship level Bluetooth audio SOC, Oppo's second self developed chip, and a new breakthrough in our long term investment in audio and connectivity innovation. Developing an SOC is a very long and challenging process. 
and the launch of My Silicon Y today marks a new milestone in Oppo's chip development journey as we focus on innovating to meet real user needs. Through our long-term roadmap, we will develop the core technologies that will lead to all new intelligent connected mobile experience, creating fresh surprises with each breakthrough. We look forward to sharing more updates on our chip and d progress in the near future. Now, let me introduce Yu Chen, who will introduce our second exciting announcement of the day. Hello, everyone. I'm Yu Chen. It's great to be with you at InnoDay to share the latest achievements in our health technology development. Last year, OPPO announced a new strategy for health-related technology. Under this new approach, we'll use our expertise in fundamental technologies like algorithms, sensors, and data science to empower health-related products and services. Through these efforts and innovative technologies, we're empowering users to be more proactive in managing and improving their health. Today, we are sharing the latest developments in OPPO's healthy lifestyle concept. In 2021, we established OPPO Health Lab, exploring new technologies to drive innovation in healthcare and developing consumer-focused health management solutions. The first development from this team was OPPO Sense, a set of algorithms designed to enhance the accuracy of health data collection on smartwatch devices. We also established O Health, a new OPPO sub brand dedicated to bringing smart and convenient health services to users while promoting the development of preventative health care. However, the transition from reactive care to preventative care will not be easy. When it comes to preventative health care, a long-term and systematic approach is necessary. When treating the common cold, the patient needs at least three vitals to be monitored. Heart rate, blood oxygen saturation, and body temperature. Taking these measurements can be complicated and time-consuming, making it difficult to track changes throughout the day. To help solve these problems, I'm excited to introduce the first product under our All Health brand, the All Health H1. The H1 is a 6-in-1 family health monitor that combines multiple sensing modalities, including blood oxygen, ECG, auscultation, heart rate, sleep, and body temperature. This is All Health H1. As you can see, it's slim light and easy to hold, weighing around 100 grams, even a child can use it easily. The simple, curved shape of H1 is heavily influenced by our human-centric design approach in health technology. We would like to change the perception of medical technology as being unfriendly and distant. So, people will be more willing to use their health devices on a regular basis. Unlike traditional medical equipment, the H1 prototype features beautifully rounded edges and a concentric oval design that makes it stand out among other devices. Taking care of our health doesn't just mean getting a checkup every now and then or visiting a doctor when something goes wrong. It's a lifelong commitment. This insight has led to another human-centric approach to the H1's appearance. Designed to look like a typical home ornament, the H1 seamlessly fits into a home environment. The H1 is also designed for enhanced interaction between human and device. As a home health monitor combining six sensing modalities, H1 places all the sensors on the rear of the device in a compact, symmetrical design for easy daily operating while complying with medical device standards. To help you form the habit of monitoring your health every day, 
you can make measurements without needing to wake the device up or operate it from your phone. Once you place the sensor correctly, the H1 will automatically detect your temperature, blood oxygen saturation, ECG, and heart rate. Recording precise measurement separately or in one fast monitoring measurement. Now, let's take a closer look at the specific functions of the device, starting with ECG monitoring. The H1's ECG sensor is built with a set of larger stainless steel electrodes than those used in current smartwatches. Together with OPPO's ECG algorithm, it can accurately detect more potential heart risk, such as arrhythmia and atrial fibrillation. In fact, when it comes to detect effort and premature heartbeats, the H1 performs at a similar level to single-lead ECG used in medical institutions. Blood oxygen saturation is a key indicator for monitoring cardiopulmonary conditions. Smartwatches measure blood oxygen by checking the level of oxygen saturation in the capillaries on top of the wrist. However, the number of capillaries in the wrist is far less than those in your fingertips, which can lead to less accurate measurements. By detecting oxygen saturation in fingertip capillaries using a PPG, the H1 significantly improves the accuracy of blood oxygen monitoring. So, without leaving the house, you and your family can record hospital standard blood oxygen levels to better understand your physical conditions. The H1 can even accurately measure the body temperature by combining infrared measurements of the forehead and room temperature, together with measuring physical distance between the device and body using a top sensor. H1 also provides accurate touch-free and interference-free sleep monitoring. All you need to do is place H1 near your pillow or your body during sleep. The high-precision MU inside H1 can monitor subtle vibrations in the mattress generated by breathing, heartbeats, and body movement during sleep. This data is then analyzed by the OppoSense algorithm developed by the OPPO Health Lab. You don't need to wear any device, so it's zero burden. And you can see your sleep data on the OHealth app every morning. The OHealth app also features blood pressure data monitoring. We have worked with Omron, the world's leading health equipment and services provider, to offer convenient, smart, and accurate blood pressure measurement. In addition to monitoring common physiological data, the H1 can also function as a stethoscope. Since cardiopulmonary sound plays an important role in the early screening of cardiac abnormalities and respiratory diseases, the H1 uses a self-developed piezoelectric ceramic sensor stack to act as an electric stethoscope. This innovative design delivers excellent signal quality with a stable frequency response. Just place the H1 onto your chest and back as guided bed images. You can record the sound of your heart and lungs with enough details and precision for doctors to make an accurate diagnosis. The main frequency bands of cardiopulmonary sound are in the middle and low frequency ranges, which is also where weak signals often occur in remote auscultation equipment. By properly composition for this weaker frequency band, H1 improves sound clarities, reduces environmental noise, and captures clear audio of users' heart and lungs. The sound clarity is even comparable to professional stethoscopes in a clinical setting. Of course, any diagnosis using cardiopulmonary sounds should be done by a professional. Users can share the physiological data collected by their H1 device 
with their doctors via the All Health app. They can also discuss the findings on telemedicine video calls and receive medical advice direct to their phone. Designed for healthcare professionals, the All Health Clinic app will also help doctors, clinics, and hospitals worldwide to better connect patients with the support they need. Doctors will be able to contact patients if they notice abnormalities or any potentially risk trends from the uploaded health data. If consent is given, the data will be stored on the cloud for up to two years. We hope that through this type of telemedicine approach, the H1 can help people to detect or even prevent health issues developing at an early stage. In addition to providing telemedicine solutions, the H1 also explores AI-assisted diagnosis based on OPPO's extensive AI research. Using AI algorithms, the H1 will be able to identify abnormalities in our ECG and cardiopulmonary sounds. We hope that using AI to conduct primary health screening could help reduce the burden on our stretched medical resources, providing equal access to diagnosis and treatment. For families with chronic diseases like hypertension and COPD, the All Health app will help them to monitor their health on a daily basis. For instance, the app can send targeted reminders to different users, reminding patients with chronic diseases when it's time to take their health readings, and helping them to form long-term health monitoring habits. Ongoing data is useful for helping people better understand the status of their recovery, monitor the effectiveness of medicines, and make better preparations for the next stage in their treatment. Whenever we provide products or services, OPPO always places personal privacy above all else. Our telemedicine, AI-assisted diagnosis, and daily health management services are all conducted according to the most stringent data security requirements. All user data is stored locally by default, and users have absolute control over how their data is used. Data can only be uploaded to the cloud platform with user authorization, and can only be seen by doctors for the purpose of diagnosis. Data used for AI-assisted diagnosis or telemedicine functions will be encrypted and stored on the OPPO Health Cloud. OPPO currently operates four overseas data centers in India, Germany, North America and Singapore, where all data is subject to the highest level of security. It is stored and processed in strict accordance with local laws and regulations. The OPPO Health Cloud Platform also complies with EU GDPR data privacy and security regulations, ensuring your health data is kept safe. Before we wrap up, let's quickly take a look at the highlights of All Health's first family health monitor, the All Health H1, in this video.
As the first product from All Health, the H1 sets the stage for our ambition to build a bridge to better care, offering smart, professional, and convenient healthcare solutions to users, clinics, and hospitals. By unlocking the huge potential of smart health devices, software, and services, we hope to give everyone the tools they need to pay closer attention to their health and improve it by making easy lifestyle adjustments. We also look forward to seeing more partners to join us to build an open ecosystem and create a better future through innovation. Thank you for your attention. Now, let me hand you back to Leo. Thank you, Yu Cheng and Jiang Bo. Today, we take the next step towards the future of smart living with the remarkable OPPO Mary Silicon Y and the new O Health H1. Determined to be open for more, OPPO is building a connected ecosystem in which everyone is seen and heard, and where we empower each other to build a better world. Thank you for joining OPPO Inno Day 2022. See you next time.